Hello and welcome to this tutorial. My name is Tilo. In this tutorial, we will learn how to use the group value chaser. We will work again with the results of the tutorial create fixture groups. As task, we have to create a group value chaser which should be stored at the group reset1. The group value chaser should fade the dimmer values between 0 and 255 in a kind of even odd mode. The fade type of all chaser steps should be set to ease out bounds, the fade time set to 2 seconds and the wait time set to 0 seconds. Group preset number 2, the group values of all fixture groups should be set to 255. Now let us start. We are already in the group control view of Matrix. If you don't know how to change the views in Matrix, please have a look at the tutorial using the group control for live operation. But now we will start to create our chaser which should be stored at preset number 1. First of all, we open the chaser window, therefore we navigate to the group control chaser, perform a right click and select edit in the context menu. Now the chaser opens. To learn more about chasers in Matrix, please have a look at the tutorial working with layer chasers in Matrix. As first step, we want to change the value of the group bar to zero. And then we click the plus button. At the second step, we want to change the value of the fixture group bar to 255 and the value of the fixture group bar to zero. That's are our two chaser steps. Now we want to change the fade type, fade time and wait time. According to our task, these settings are equals for all steps. So we can multi-select these two steps by pressing and holding the shift key. Select the first one and the last one. Now we perform a right click and change the fade type to ease out bounds. The fade time again with a right click at one of these columns, two seconds and the wait time, zero seconds. That's it. We can start this chaser. Now we can close it and we want to save it and call it chaser at the preset number one. Therefore, we click the set button. According to our task, we have to create a second group preset. Therefore, we want to stop the chaser first. That's simply possible with a click at the chaser button, then we want to clear the chaser and we change the values for all fixture groups to the value 255. We call it pool, sorry, pool on and click set again. Now we save it at preset number two. When we now test our configuration, we start the chaser by clicking preset number one. And we can see the result at the main out preview. If we want to stop the chaser, we simply have to select the group preset number two. That's it for now. Thank you for watching.